Hello everyone, this is Sephiroth's Awakening, and welcome back to Let's Play Star Ocean Second Evolution for the PlayStation Portable. In the last episode, we beat three, another three of the Ten Wise Men. Now there's only four left, and now I gotta go through Phenol Tower to try and find them. This tower is so confusing though. And the enemies are pretty powerful. Oh yeah, I forgot to scan these guys. I don't even know what they are. There's so many ep uh, different enemies here in Fino. Uh, spectacles. Where art thou, spectacles? Uh, haven't we fought them? In the, uh, our first encounter with the Ten Wisemen in Phenol Tower? I believe it was a Mirror 64 and, uh, Gunner Guy. Forgot. Machine Gun Robot. Forgot its name. And I completely do not know my way around this tower. Anyways, uh, I believe on the first floor there's like two to three different uh, warps to the, the second floor. So, yeah, I could be heading in the wrong direction completely. Just some spiders again, Mirror 64. No, there's no hidden entrance over there. Derp. Ooh, interesting. Creepy. We better be careful. Ah, some new enemies or old enemies. Maybe the same ones we fought earlier. Tacky Codus. Never heard of it. They have 25k HP though, and they are very dangerous. They can basically decimate your HP with their machine gun fire. So make sure you bring your A team here. Your B team will be cut down by machine gun fire. <laughs> or eaten if you encounter one of those uh, giant slug glob enemies. Ooh, fourth floor already. Either I must be getting lucky on the directions, or I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> and I'm heading in the completely wrong way. Anyways, spectacles. The uh, as always, these uh, globby, globby guys can eat you, so be careful with them. Luckily, they're pretty weak. If you don't use a killer move that has a long uh, startup time, you should be fine. But if you use a move that has a long startup time, they'll just sit there and eat you while you're trying to get your killer move off. Ah, this looks promising. Well, I'll, I'll accept free charger. Fist of the Titan. I believe that's Bowman's weapon, but we don't have Bowman. We have Pressus. We can handle this. This will be over in 10 seconds. All right, in this fight, we have new toaster enemies. Flying toasters. And, yeah, Nikuya LM. Very weak. And I'm not exactly sure what their purpose is. But they were in the battle. All right, let's try the left side then. More treasure. Atomic Puncher got better. And finally, please, right side. Nope. Just a bunch of treasure rooms this way, so let's see what this treasure is. Rune shoes. Don't know if that's any good, actually. Alright, heading back out. Back down to floor three, then. Man, I'm so lost. <laughs> How 
annoying. We can handle this. New enemies yet again. Two new enemies, in fact. Dark Crusaders and Succubus. Let's take a look at these Dark Crusaders first. Also, that Succubus is very powerful. Once I get a Spectacles on her, I'm taking her out. 21k HP, and her thing is basically drains you down to dangerous HP levels with one hit. So, be wary of that. Alright, back down to the third floor. Alright, let's try the left then. Just some more of those machine gunner guys. Three, huh? Does this lead down to floor two? Nope, leads to floor four, yay! This is bad. Be careful! Now this is bad. This guy is completely honest. This guy is a very powerful enemy, but it gives a freaking <laughs> super generous helping of H or EXP. So I'm gonna use an experience card here. Best thing to do is spam that dragon roar. I forgot to even look at his HP amount. But it's really high. Alright, I'm gonna save my dragon roars. As you can see, he's basically doing a number on our team. But when we're done, 91,000 experience. Two levels. Nice. What? I thought I spent DS's skill points. Alright, I spent everyone's skill points in my main team. Oh, this looks promising. I say as I run into a succubus. And just remember this place may be a maze now. But just remember, we gotta go through this place backwards later on. But yeah, we gotta go through this place again in reverse. Alright, a save point. This means there is a boss battle up ahead. This is not the most important save point, though. Let me find... Ooh, a new slot. Yay! Anyways, um, there's a boss ahead, obviously. And, uh, anyways, what I was saying is we have to go through the tower to leave it later on for a side quest. But, anyways, boss time. We got visitors, honey -o. You trash! We've had enough of your meddling! Let's go, Michael! Hold on! Ain't no need to rush things! Huh? Looks like they killed everyone below us! Man, this is pathetic! Now it's your turn! I hope you're ready! <laughs> you're gonna kill us? <laughs> That's funny! <laughs> I haven't laughed this hard in ages! What's so funny about that? Ooh, tough crowd! You have no idea what you've gotten yourselves into, do you? You made it this far, I'll credit you that. How about we celebrate it by beating you to death? You do realize that this is completely meaningless. Resistance is futile. I think we'll need to teach you that no matter how much you worms wiggle, you're still nothing but worms in the end. Two more of the Ten Wise Men. 
This is tough. This ought to be a decent fight. It is time to teach you all a lesson. I'll jar your very bones. Now, the thing is, these guys are not like the pushovers on the first floor. At least I hope they're not. Michael and Hanio. Michael, let's take a look at it. 180,000 HP. As you can see, um, obviously resistant to fire. In fact, his face is on fire, so yeah, he'd be resistant to fire. And what about the other guy? And Hanayo. Only 130,000. Oh god, this is his powerful fire attack. It's called a Spicule. Does decent damage to all targets, but while he was doing that, we took care of his little friend there. And this is basically how I go through the Ten Wise Men. Steamroll them with gear and levels. <laughs> Could have used experience card there, but I didn't. Oh well, my lost. Indeed, Reyna. Alright, let's save here. Now that we've beaten these two guys. And I'm going to end the episode here. So see you guys next time.